we got this. We're gonna manifest huge things for you. Woo! So exciting. Okay, now let's do a deep exercise. So now these are your thoughts and feelings and your actions. Doors, right? Help others. Yeah, amazing. In their business. I, I want you to put this in the fire. This is your old thoughts, your feelings, and things that don't serve you. That needs to go in there. Wow. And then you... Right now or when? Yeah, you can okay. go right now before <laughs> we begin. We're going to okay. get rid of it. Okay. All right. So goodbye to my worry, stress, being reactive, regretful, panic, anxiety, and overly emotional. Amazing. Ciao. Bye. Oh! Oh my God. There it goes. There it goes. Bye. Wow. Look at that. Mm-hmm. You see? It does it's, a good, it's good to have a visual of that. Yeah. You know? Goodbye. Right. Now let's do the exercise. Okay. I'm going to do a really brief one with you because I feel like a lot has come out for you with this exercise. Mm -hmm. I want you to keep these, your thoughts, your feelings, and your actions, mm -hmm. and that version of you. That keep with you every day. And I want you to read it every day aloud to yourself three times a day. Okay. Literally whenever you can. Stick it up in your bathroom. Take it with you. Just pull it out. It's just the point where someone's like, what are you doing? It's like, oh, just reading out my statement about myself. You know, <laughs> who are you? You know, it's your own, it's your own compass. This is who I am. So every day I want you to do that. These, you just need to start looking at. When you just lose track of who you are, just come over and be like, she would not be dealing with it like this. And yeah. every time you go back to this dissolved motherfucker in the fire, guess what happens? You put distance <laughs> between what you want in your life and who you're playing now. Right. You write your movie and you choose your character. Mm -hmm. You are writing this script. If you continue to act in a sad way with the death well, by the way we all have those days but if you mull on it longer and you allow it to swamp you you are putting so much more distance between that version of you who could show up in the next it's year true. it's true if you allow it and become her now which is literally it be it until you become it become the version of you so that's not fake it till you make it because that's bullshit it's actually living it right okay. i hate but fake you know it what you I, can you answer one question for me when people say, and, and you have zero dollars in your bank account, and then someone like you comes and says, well, I mean, someone in your industry says to you on Instagram, and they go, no, what you have to say 10 times is I have $5 million in the bank, and you know, you're, you're, you don't though. So you're supposed to say that you do over and over again, and then hope that you will, and then you will. So I mean, what is that about? So that is your thoughts becoming things, but there's more to it than that. The right. science would say there's a part in your brain called the reticular activating system. It filters 2 million bits of data every second. This is some neuroscience for you, which okay. is all in the book. Okay. <laughs> and what it does, it shows you things that you deem as important. So if you deem as important uh, being a multimillionaire, you deem as important having five million in the bank, and you truly believe you're worthy of it, and you truly think about it all the time, and you just imagine what you could do with that five million, the resources you have now that you have that five million, your ticket eye credit system in your brain shows you evidence around you to prove that belief system is real through people, events, and places. So you start seeing around you other people who are in that realm. You start hanging out with people who are just, you know, all, all resonating in that place. You raise your average, and all of a sudden, because of the people, events, and places around you showing you that it's true that you're a multi millionaire, you bring it to fruition. It's just science. Right. It's almost like it, one thing leads to another. Absolutely. In a Suddenly. way that's like, if you're not thinking that way, then you'll never leave your apartment. Mm -hmm. You'll never go mm -hmm. to that, mm -hmm. you know, business mm -hmm. um, dinner or whatever. So and something, take that meeting. You, wanna, you know it. You know it. Right. Like literally, you'll walk out and then you'll be like, somebody bumped into me, this stranger, and they happen to be my next investor. Yeah. You're like out of nowhere. I swear, opportunity's coming. No, honey, the opportunity was always there. You just saw it with different shades. Yeah. That's all it is. So now you're going to see and accept and feel this whole new world because you're changing your narrative.